weekend, and that can be a very busy time for many places, including emergency rooms. And this year, it's a little more complicated because of the coronavirus. Channel 3's Kara Sunland has more. Joining me now to talk about visits to the emergency department is Dr. Anij Vora, and he specializes in emergency medicine at Charlotte Hungerford Hospital in Torrington. Thanks for being with us. Oh, it's my pleasure. Thanks so much for having me here. So it's a complicated time, but this is always a weekend where you see some injuries. What are the things you're worried about most that maybe people could uh, prevent? Absolutely. So we, we expect burn injuries. So please take precautions, make sure you're wearing your goggles, make sure you're wearing gloves to protect your hands. We expect laceration injuries also, so please be careful with sharp cutlery. And again, wearing gloves will help protect you from that. Hydration is also key. It's gonna be a warm weekend, some beautiful weather even today. So make sure you're staying hydrated because if you get dehydrated in the sun, it can lead to heat exhaustion and that can lead to heat stroke, which can present like stroke-like symptoms. So we just wanna make sure that people are safe, warm, hydrated, gloved, and protected for uh, barbecue injuries. Plus there's a pandemic. So how is COVID complicating things as far as what you're seeing in the emergency department? Absolutely. So COVID, as we know about, runny nose, cough, congestion, body aches, vomiting, abdominal pain. Those are the classic uh, symptoms. But now we're seeing COVID with heart attacks. We're seeing COVID with strokes. So what we're recognizing is this illness is getting into the body and starting to cause some real bad dysfunction. At Hartford Healthcare has over 10 different emergency departments throughout Connecticut. And we're there and, and we want people to come in and get taken care of so you leave healthier. And the key element is come in, get evaluated, get diagnosed, and leave healthier than you came in. And you're gonna be treated safely, that's for sure. And briefly, before I have to let you go, you want people to know that they shouldn't wait it out at home. They really need to get to the hospital or the urgent care and that that's safe. Absolutely, but what we're seeing is people are getting sicker at home. And when they come in, those are the people you hear about that get breathing tubes placed and all of these other advanced procedures. What you want to do is come in early so that we can diagnose you and treat you early on so yeah. you don't get ill. And there's been no safer time to come to emergency departments because of how hygienic we have been and how cleanly we are. So if you have symptoms, don't take a chance. Yeah. Come and get evaluated. Doctor, thank you so much for your time. My pleasure. Thanks for having me.